Um, circling back to Hecla Mining, um, that's, uh, I, I think they're the biggest silver producer in the U.S., I, I think North America. Um, if someone wants to fact check me on that, please, please feel free. But um, they're, they're such a major player. Um, can you... I always like sort of origin stories uh, on these types of things. Um, it's, it's a little bit of that entrepreneur background that I bring is um, is just knowing that first day that someone's even willing to have the conversation with you and and start that process. And Hecla Mining, I mean, that's that's about as big as it gets, really. So, um, can you do you know the origin story of how that conversation got started with them, and then then going through the process of them actually onboarding the technology? Uh, no, unfortunately, I do not. Uh, here's what I would say, though, and, and Hecla can certainly speak for themselves, but we're very proud to have them as a partner. And and, uh, and if you do any research on Hecla, you'll find out how innovative a company they are. Mm-hmm. And and you know, any of the audience can see the press release that um, you know that announced the the partnership that we have. Yeah, we'll, their, we'll put a link. Or access well. to face capture. That that'd be great. But here's what I would say in general. You know, look. As I said, we spent we spent eight years working with the the mining industry in all manner of scanning applications. Uh, Hecla clearly was one of those, based on what you can all see publicly at this point. Um, and in their partnership with us has been instrumental. Uh, they are not the only ones; uh, they're the only ones that are public right now. And you'll start to see mm. a steady stream of additional announcements as time goes on. Here, uh, I'll generally characterize that history and, and what it's meant for us, uh, Jared. If that's okay, yeah, that's fine. Um, you know, look, we, we like all companies, uh, technology companies that, that I've seen and been a part of, especially in industrial applications. You know, in other words, I'm not a B2C guy. Um, the applications that I've seen or the, the stories that I've seen are start with great idea with some connection to, um, to a specific domain or a specific industry. Start building out that idea and testing the waters with key players. Uh, do consulting projects, basically insulating the end user from the inconvenience of a lack of an interface or whatever else. Eat your own dog food by testing your technology and delivering results for companies and build it out into or to a level that ultimately allows users to access the technology and use it for their own benefit, but only do so after you've tested it again, by insulating the customer from all of those inconveniences as you're mm-hmm. building a product. So we spent eight years doing that. And look, there have been a lot of success stories in that time. There definitely have been a lot of you know, lessons learned going down some wrong roads, but that's the character now of the company, the experience that we have behind us and what's led us to face capture. Now with Hecla and let's just say a few other companies, they have led us to this application. To me, in my simplified world, I'm sure there's somebody in, in mining that spent 30 years that may characterize it differently, and they would be right too. But in my simplified view of the the scanning world, the digitization world of the life of a mine, intended and otherwise, you end up drilling a mine, it converges, that's unintended. Uh, you drill a shaft, you have to inspect it. If there's a problem, you have to fix it, that's unintended. If you're at a mine face and you're blasting and you're trying to track a seam, that's intended. But in any case, um, all of that scanning, they fit into two basic char- uh, characters. Uh, one is production applications. That's where face capture fits. Yeah. The other one is inspection applications, which might be more periodic. It probably wouldn't surprise you that our customer base, as we've been working with all of these applications over eight years, said, if you could only do this at the production phase, it would have X, Y, Z value. Mm and has basically led us to this. So it's not an idea that was foreign to us necessarily, but the extent of the value, the disproportionate value by solving some of these key production problems at the face was really reinforced and emphasized uh, by Hecla and other customers as we've been working with them over the last eight years. 